Hello, beautiful people of the internet. My name is Ryan. Welcome back to episode 50 of the Blood and Wine DLC. 50 episodes. Can't hardly believe it. Hey, uh, we, in the last episode, followed a little bit... I mean, first off, we defeated Detlaf uh, on our first try of that of that episode. First try of today, actually. Uh, which feels pretty good. I'm feeling feeling nice. I'm feeling like I really have conquered Death March difficulty, which is a good feeling. Uh, after that, we followed a couple remaining clues. There was supposed Which to be a fifth victim for, uh, you know, Tiana's, Tiana's plan. And, uh, who was that person supposed to be? We tracked down the boot black, asked for a little bit more information, and he was willing to give it to us. Uh, we found a couple beggars who had been delivering notes, and we found the fifth note. Anna Henrietta was supposed to be the fifth uh, victim, um, which Anna Henrietta does not know. And I suppose I'm going to go tell. Uh, I'm going to go talk to Sian about why it is that she wanted to do that. Um, I have to find a way past the uh, the guards first off, though. I'm going to try going up this way real quick. Apparently, it's below me. All right, never mind. We're going to try going this way. That's the plan for this episode. Uh, last episode just made me nervous. Uh, the reason for that is things weren't wrapping up particularly smoothly here with this DLC. And that made me start to question everything. Regis wants to continue tracking down information. Why? information in and of itself is great. I'm a big fan. Uh, I'd like to know as much as possible. I'd like to know the full story. I'd like to get the full picture. But, uh... But Regis knew a piece of information that I didn't know. I don't want to I don't want to judge Regis. I don't want to suspect Regis. But, uh... So I'm, I'm trying to avoid that. But... Now I'm nervous. Alt. Need to All see right. Sienna. Urgently. In the matter of? Ooh. Here's the question. First thing in the episode. They're going to ask me if I want to reveal the assassination attempt. Or plan. Oh, fuck. If I, if I say it, opinion against her is already bad. I'm, I'm afraid if I say it, Tiana will be killed outright. Um, either by guards gone mad or who love who love the du Duquesa or some other, re or she'll be poisoned or something like that. If I don't say it, I'm afraid that Anna Henrietta will be endangered because I knew information and didn't say it. On the other hand, this one, if I say this, or if, if, I, if I say this, maybe I have a better chance of talking to her. Want to talk to her? It's important. Want to talk? Go see your gran at tea time. Not one locked up on the Duquesa's orders. No doing without special permission. Period. Found some information important to her case. Need an explanation. Urgently. Ah, fine then. He, he folds. You're that witcher who solved the murders, no? Then you for my permission, but only for a few minutes. Promise to be brief. Okay. Interesting. Follow the guard to Sienna's cell. Okay. God, I'm fucking nervous. Let's go. The Witcher will speak with the inmate. You can take a momentary break. As long as it's truly but a moment. Highly irregular, this. Oh, now it's going to look sketchy if she disappears. Have you come to see how I fare? I'm fine, thank you. Artorius' ribbon worked wonders. It's a shame they took it from I me. I know who the fifth victim was supposed to be. Look at that light. Look at that light. Goodness, you're simply a compulsive snoop. I'm in prison. Deadlaf is dead. Could you not just drop it? Sienna, stop pretending you couldn't care less. I know it's an act, and it's really starting to wear. Why do you want to kill her? For such an accomplished investigator to ask about the obvious? Come now, Geralt. Why do you think? Tell me, Sienna. Uh, I would hear to. I would prefer to hear it from your mouth 
I'm nervous because uh, Siana has has kept these reasons kind of close to the heart. And so what if I say something and then she just leads me to believe her or to believe that reason? My guess, honestly, is this. She turned her back on you and forgot about you. I think that's putting on my most empathetic hat, my most, the most generous reading of what Siana might have come uh, up with for a reason, for, for why Siana might have done it. I think this is possible. I don't particularly lean towards this, but. Because she turned her back on you, then banished all memory of you. Bravo, Geralt. Yet another riddle solved, and your sick curiosity sated. That was good, good voice acting. So full well, of venom. What now? Off to share your discovery with Anna Henrietta. Though she's no longer in danger, true. But she very well might add a little something to your reward. Definitely gonna tell her. Not necessarily for the coin, though. Then why do it at all? She ought to know. If only because you'll probably try to kill her again if she ever lets you out. I probably will. <laughs> Honesty, finally. What a, f what a fuck you this line would be. Have you ever thought to forgive her? What a fuck you that line would be. At least you're being honest, finally. Lying only ever makes sense when there's a chance someone will believe you. You've done your fair share it's of that. It's actually refreshing, in a way, to say what I truly think. So why don't I do it a bit Please, more? Please, I'd love to hear more. I was only ever nice to you to get you to sleep with me. I thought you might come in handy one day. Your comrade Regis is using you, and Anna Henrietta perceives you solely as her unthinking, blunt instrument. She's right to you now. Okay, so, so far we've got, this is, oh, uh, my, my pulse is picking up. Uh, Regis is using you. For what end? For what end? Truly. I can imagine a couple, but oh, I don't like hearing them. Uh, I don't like thinking about them. Anna Henrietta is treating me as an instrument because in some ways I am. In many ways I'm not, but in some ways that is my use for her. And you only... Was ever were ever nice to me in order to get me to sleep with you? I I didn't sleep with you, and you weren't frankly that nice. Like hurting people, don't you? Or and you're a pathetic, petty viper. Enjoy hurting people. That it. Sorry, but won't give you the satisfaction. The Witcher mutations, you know. It's hard to draw my blood. Don't worry. Hard I'll to find draw my blood. Have a nice life, Siana. What was that? De la Tour would like to see you. Still Shall here? Go at once? Need to tend to one thing first. I'll look in on them afterwards. So be it. Regis? Is it Regis? The one thing that I can tend to, it doesn't sound like... Uh... I actually get a specific thing that I should do. Ah, now I'm so curious about that dialogue. I can't go back, can I? I sort of want to reload it and just see what else happens there. I Oh, I've never wanted so badly to see what other dialogue does. Uh, I'm going to continue on as is uh, because I think it's awfully fun to just see where this takes us. All right, let's see where it takes us. Okay. Let's go to Damien. Damien. 
Interesting, interesting, interesting. I think I can technically fast travel there a little bit quicker. Yeah. Huh. All right. Man. It, this game has me very nervous right now. They're doing a great job at sort of... Uh... Oh, Geralt. You all right there? Um, cultivating that feeling that uh, you get... If you've, ever, if you've ever watched something like Mind Hunter, or uh, it's it's the feeling of like sitting across the table from a serial killer for an interview, or uh, hearing an interview with the family member of a person who did a terrible thing. You're just like, how's your brain working? What's what's going on in there? Is there something very scary, dangerous in there? The Duquesa's champion, Damien, get out. It's about time. Ready for the ceremony. Uh, you don't look too good. Now, should we tell him? Oh, damn. I have to tell someone, but I would prefer to tell Anna Henrietta. Damien would be the one person other one, otherwise that I would tell, the person who is in charge of Anna, Henri Anna Henrietta's safety. Your face doesn't look good. Though it looked even worse last I saw you. Hey, you're alive. I apply a balm of Annika. Yeah, I hardly feel it anymore. God, that's beautiful. Got some important information. Anna Henrietta was supposed to be Detloff and Siana's fifth victim. You are certain of this? Completely. Found proof. Inconceivable. How could she? The murders, the mayhem she brought down on the city, were they not enough? She sought to strike down her own sister. Her liege. Her liege. Trader. LOL. I must alert my men. Enlarge the Duchess's honor guard. Make certain Sylvia Anna is closely watched during the questioning. I'll see to it personally. I thank you, Witcher, for alerting me. And I appreciate your attentiveness. Let's begin oh, the we're going to see if any of this Come is... I wonder if the this Duchess is... Uh, I wonder if these dialogue options are going to be affecting what happens here. Because it, f it certainly fucking feels like it. Choosing to withhold... A, a decision to choose or withhold that information, that has to affect the outcome. I was a little bit uncertain. I was like, maybe the dialogue with Siana would go a number of different ways and you just get sort of a different piece of the puzzle depending on how you talk to her. Maybe it doesn't actually affect what happens next. Telling Damien 100% has to affect what happens next because it's a huge piece of information. God, I hope I made the In right the decision. In the guild's name, I beg your assistance, your enlightened highness. Without barrels, Production will come to a stop. First time we see Anna Henrietta since the you lost them all attack on the, the city. Fire. These are horrible tidings. Let's see how oh, she we are leads. most dreadfully saddened. Yes, your enlightened highness all. Once the beasts had clawed their way into the warehouse, the whole place went up in flames. I shall dispatch a palace guardsman to examine the site of the blaze. If things are as you say, fitting compensation shall be paid from the ducal treasury. Thank you, your enlightened highness. Your grace, Geralt of Rivia has arrived. My dear subjects, we come now to our next point of business. Okay. Of all the duties which fall upon my shoulders, as the ruler of this dominion, this duty is dearest to my heart. For now, we shall award the Order of Vitis Vinifera, Tucson's highest honor. Geralt of Rivia, slayer of the beast of Beauclair, step forth. <coughs> We bestow the distinction upon the Witcher, who saved Beauclair from the terrible beast. Such is our desire. Oh wow, got a steam achievement too. May this symbol serve as a reminder to all that the Witcher shall forever remain a friend of Beauclair. Poison? Why are we drinking? 
In more familiar terms now, I thank you immensely, Geralt. Damien has your reward for you. After all, it was but a contract. Thank you. I have a small surprise How much money? for you. In How much money? I give 5, you more than a dozen barrels of oh. Sangreal, a wine normally reserved We're for the ducal table. Oh, I know what Sangreal is. The gustatory is. experience of a lifetime awaits. Are you content? Now I get to choose whether to give this information here. I'll be honest, what this uh, scene has made me feel mostly so far is uh, it's a like bittersweet award ceremony. We're the hero, right? The hero of an entire area. This is very Skyrim. We've saved the whole area from death and destruction. We are the protagonist. But it's also a a, an area, a kingdom beset with uh, unvirtuous behavior from those in the highest positions. And as much as I like Anna Henrietta, and I really do like Anna, Hen Anna Henrietta, uh, I just feel a little bit uh, dirty wearing this thing on my chest. But also proud, but also like, you know, it's not dirty, but it's just like, but what does the opinion of these fuckers matter other than Anna Henrietta, who is queen? Uh... I think I'll tell her. I am, and truly grateful, Your Grace. Sadly, I'm afraid I have to sour the mood. It's Sienna. She plotted to have you killed, Duchess. Planned to use Dedloff. You were to be the Beast's fifth victim. This cannot be true. You're mistaken. You must be. I have proof. How will this change? I, I feel bad that I had to tell her in person, in front of people. I do not believe it. Only those in power like that can say things like that in and not moment, get laughed at. I speak. To Siana. Will you assist me? Hell yes. Hell yes, I you will. You returned my sister to me, yet what you tell me now I find devastating. I've come to doubt that I can judge her fairly. I'd far prefer to learn you're mistaken, Geralt. I'm not. In fact, I'd recommend you be particularly careful around her. You exaggerate, Witcher. She is my sister. I know well how to speak to her. If my presence will help in any manner, of course I'll stay. We shall now question a person implicated in the murders which recently ravaged our fair city of Beauclair. Captain oh, she's coming Tour, here. Okay. Show Sylvia Anna in. Okay. I'm nervous. Who's Anna Henrietta? The Witcher will take part in our talk. God, why does everything feel so important right now? Jesus Christ. All right, I'm thinking through everything and I'll try and think through it out loud so that you know what I'm feeling. On the one hand, Duchess asked me to stay might actually hurt Anna Henrietta's case of her caring about Siana in a weird way. Oh, Anna Henrietta's scared of me. Oh, Anna Henrietta wanted her, her tool at her side, her sword at her side. On the other hand, free to do as I choose is not exactly the, t I mean, it is the truth, but it's, it's the, the truth is that Anna Henrietta asked me to stay. I'm going to pick the second one. Though. I'm not a prisoner. Free to do as I choose. You have committed crimes. I Here's the problem with what I think, what I'm thinking, I believe. A, a part of me, a good, a good sized part of me still wants 
Sianna and Anna Henrietta to come to some sort of understanding. For Sianna, I think the most potent thing that I can think of would be for Sianna to realize that Anna Henrietta truly cares for her. The problems I see with that is that anything Anna Henrietta does in so public a situation as the leader of, uh, you know, the ducal area or whatever, uh, is going to seem like a performance. So how can Sianna ever know what Anna Henrietta truly feels? On the other hand, yeah, anyways, anyways. Grave crimes. Why do I want that Yet resolution? You are my sister, and my heart does not allow me to treat She's you committed as a so many criminal. Nor crimes does it and let me believe you sought my demise. My heart yearns to know you were swayed by the monster Detlaf. You yourself would never stoop so low. Thus I have asked Geralt to advise me as one impartial. Yikes. I shall now hear what he has to say. I don't know about impartial. The light is really flickering here. I hope it doesn't affect things too much. Sorry if you see the screen flickering. Sianna should be punished like any criminal, or the good of the duchy, that is what matters most. Is that the opposite? Can those both be true? Mostly what I personally believe is that Sianna is a... Is that Sianna has shown a coldness and a... And a cunning so great that I worry... And, and such a talent for acting that I worry that she might never... That I worry about leaving her close to you at all. And I worry about whether or not she could she could change i hope that she ch she could change i want her to change i don't know what to think here but man the vibes from siana are just all bad all the time your grace as head of state you should look first and foremost after your dominion i have no idea if i picked Sianna's the right thing actions what drove them be damned. and i don't know that i agree with what i picked to your subjects you are correct. They are what matters. I must not forget this. Sianna, you shall be tried and given a fitting punishment. Yet we shall never cease to be family. Is it a dagger up her, up her sleeve? Is that what it is? I just spat all over my desk. Yikes. She was, she made, ow, I, I just punched myself in the head. She made this motion, right? And now she's got the hand behind the thing. I think I think Anna Henrietta is currently in danger. As Duchess, I shall have it's a to different judge hand, you. though. But as your sister, I shall never stop loving you. Will you forgive me? Ah, oh, shit. She's dead. Anna Henrietta dies. Oh, no. This is the end. Anna Henrietta dies here. And here's the thing, I want so badly to be the kind of person who believes, as as I believe Anna Henrietta does. I believe that Anna Henrietta thinks I have to extend myself with the possibility of forgiveness here. I have to I have to extend the olive branch. But the problem is, I think she's in danger. I shall never forgive you. Oh, no. <laughs> Holy shit. She did it with her own thing. Wow. Wow. That's a badass scene. The slow zoom out through the roof, looking over the whole. My God, the fairy tale land of Toussaint, by the way, where fables and the stories and the reality is dark as hell. Oh my God, what the fuck?
now I have to know how this changes. I, I have to know I have to know what happens there. If I can if there's a way to get out of her <coughs> to get out of that situation with uh with Anna Henrietta alive. It's not pretty, but at the very least, Anna Henrietta uh ended her life being the type of person who I think she would be proud to be, which is extending the hand of, for of an offering of forgiveness, an offering of a clean slate. Need some flowers, a wreath, or... I've none. Sold everything. I was just on my way out. No sense hanging about with nothing to do. The whole kingdom grieves. Should come as no shock, sir. Had the funeral, folk took it all. Men, women, children. All wished to lay a bouquet on the Duchess's grave. Wind flowers. Folk peonies, took it all? Gladioli. But she liked common roses best. I know. Her ladies in waiting would come here at times. I'd choose the loveliest blooms for her. Fragrant, big petals, the kind that last a long time. Ah, I've still not come to terms with it. To be killed by her own sister. How could it happen? God, this is an incredible game. Oh, man. The minute she started asking, I was like, Geralt's going to be left to answer. Geralt's going to be left to answer. We get to write the end of this story. We get to determine how Geralt feels. What's the version of events that's most true here? Was Anna Henrietta too trusting? of a person who didn't deserve it? Was Sienna too unrelenting? So unrelenting of uh, an absolute force of, of evil? Did Geralt fail by reading the situation wrong, mis misconducting affairs of politics and state? Uh, God, I don't know. I think of these options, I think I will choose I let the Duchess down, which is not what I believe necessarily, but it feels, I don't think Anna Henrietta was too trusting. I didn't think that Sienna would be so unrelenting. But mostly what it is is that I don't know, I think the final dialogue option that I had was the important one or one of the important ones. And I don't know that I fully understood what I was deciding. How quickly, unexpectedly, she was gone before I understood what was happening. Oh, I know you. You're that witcher from the north. The one that saved us from the beast. Mm-hmm. Could say that. Wait here. Take these. She still has flowers. you were out of flowers. I put a bouquet aside. I was to take it to her myself, but you have it. I know you held the Duchess dear. How much do I owe you? Not a copper. Keep your coin and raise a toast in her memory tonight. Do just that. Farewell. Oh, statue. Oh. Honorietta. Wow. Place a flower on Anna Henrietta's grave. <sighs> Damn! Ah, oh. what an emotional scene! I uh, I love the feeling of who saw right now. It's cloudy. There's stuff floating in the air. Like we're tra like we're a, a little. It's, this will forever be a little a, a moment like sort of trapped in amber of a. Uh... So young, so beautiful. The weeks that the uh, the time that the. Witcher. The Toussaint lost uh, on Henrietta. Wow. 
This is not her grave. It's just the statue, obviously. Mm. Can I light these? I kind of want to light them all. That'd be kind of cool. Damn. I don't know how this is going to work. We may actually reload here in a second. Um, kids laughing? Yo, chill, homie. We're all in grieving. Um, I may actually reload in a second, uh, depending on how this all goes. Just because I'm very curious about how that last dialogue went. Um, but I want to see what happens when we lay the, lay the thing. The other thing is that... Who would that... have thought? Knights trading in wine while some witcher guards the common folk. The other thing I would say is, uh, I'm very, I, I want to play this out because it's, it's beautiful. This feels like the day that Prince died, you know, like this feels like so, some deaths, Who some celebrity thought? deaths in particular, trading in wine. Some, some heads of state, guards the common folk. it's like a blow to an entire psyche, you know, uh, Vampires were running about town. I almost dumped my guts in fear. And it's not decent. Matter or no, she was the Duchess's sister. Oh, they're buried together. Blood. She should lie with her kin. Ah, we know how that works. There was a husband and wife uh, buried here, thirty episodes ago. They drove each other mad. Ah, Damien. I was certain you'd departed. Couldn't. Anna Henrietta was wondrous, beautiful, good, the best ruler one could hope to have. Yet I let her down. Don't be so hard on yourself. No one expected Siana to do that, persist to the end. And none of us did anything to stop her, because there was nothing we could do. Uh, I suppose you are right. But when someone so beloved dies, one cannot help but search one's soul for blame. And even the hardiest knights grow faint-hearted then. Come to pay my respects. Bid the Duchess farewell. White roses. They were her favorite. Go inside then. She lies in the ducal crypt. In one room with her murderer. Despite my protests. What? Who decided that? The Regent's Council. A pack of old men who've statutes and codices for hearts. <laughs> Ducal blood flowed in Siana's veins, and she was never legally disinherited. So they ruled she should lie alongside Anna Rieta. This is such a cool... It's, I mean, it's terrible, right? But uh, I can't believe what's happened this episode. I can't. It's crazy. The fact that Anna Henrietta extends the hand and... I think the way that I will play this one... Oh, man. Oh, I just about knocked my mouse off the screen. I can't wait to... Uh, I can't wait to rewatch... A couple different uh, versions of how this goes, but the way I will play this one is uh, is just flowers on Anna Henrietta's grave. I can't wait to see. Uh, I hope they show us another view of Sienna's grave too, because I want to see how empty it is in a fucked up sort of way. It's tough because it's not like I, I regret it ended this way. That I failed to prevent it. Hope you can forgive me. Rest in peace. I don't believe as much as Geralt does that he failed, that Siana was... I, I don't know what, what Geralt believes, but I don't think that Siana was evil. I don't think Siana was cursed. I think probably at the end of the day, Siana was a product of an entirely fucked set of circumstances around her upbringing, her exile, her birth, all of it. Stylish crypt, quite subdued. Not above blame? Yes, but... this is the kind of eternal resting place I dream of. Moments like this, I never know if you're joking or serious. Serious, Geralt, serious. It's remarkably peaceful, subtly charming to the hilt. 
a perfect match for the Duchess's dignity. I love Regis. Ah, oh, you humans, you'll never cease to amaze me. To feel despair in the face of natural processes to which you are predestined. I've come to take you from this place, my friend. Dare say you deserve a speck of respite after the mad whirl of the last few days. What if I'd have brought Regis with me to, to talk with Sienna? I don't know. God damn it. What would have happened? Could he have drawn something out of her that I couldn't have? He's, he's, frankly, he's more wise, I think. deaths I failed to prevent. I feel pretty awful right about now. Can't help thinking I could have done more. Now Toussaint's left without a ruler. Or more Toussaint. accurately, chaos rules here. Hand in hand with despair. Duchess won over people's hearts. All Beauclair now weeps for her. A mass outburst of emotion. Well, it seems her subjects have adopted some of their recent ruler's traits. Why the sarcasm? Thought you liked Donna Henrietta. I did. And I do truly rue her passing. Me too. Then let us drink. All right, Regis, preach at me. Always seemed to me you were a very complicated creature by nature. Not one to resort to such simple methods like drinking your worries away. There exist worries for which they're quite simply. It's <laughs> other medicine. <laughs> Whatever you say about Siona, you gotta admit she was unbending. That she was. She was strong I as hell. Admit it. Though in her case, it would have been better if she had been a tad more mm, philosophical, pausing from time yeah, to time also. to reflect on the propriety of her actions. True. How do you find my personal sad, view? sad life? If you look at just right, credit the local mandrake of the. If you look at Sienna's life. It was so, in a way, it was so principled and so sad for, and not in a sad romantic way, sad in a, in a purely tragic way. Yeah. Oh, no diabolus variety for that. The tubers which grow in this area's volcanic soil have an altogether unique flavor profile and display a remarkably uncommon dark brown tint. Fascinating. All I can say is this batch turned out excellent. Indeed. It might be wise to stockpile some roots for the future. Would you care to accompany me? Us? You decide this to go This feels weirdly now. full it's circle, out. Regis. Oh, Geralt. Even were I generously to assume it had simply slipped your mind that I am a vampire and thus need no light to see. I'd never believe you had also forgotten that you likewise have absolutely no trouble seeing in the dark. So, shall we? If you think it's a good idea, let's go. But I think you might be forgetting one thing. Fresh mandrake root of this variety is highly toxic, even to a witcher. Ah, not a problem. I never forget matters of safety and hygiene in alchemy. Here. Gloves and a mask. Don them, and you shall be in no danger. Oh, Thanks. are we going to put a plague mask right on? Then. Let's go. This moonlight makes me oh so dreamy. Regis, what's about to go on? What's about to happen here? I have the option to put this stuff on? I should put it on. It's fucking toxic. Option? What are you talking about over here? Uh, they're probably on my hotbar. Penny for your thoughts. Nope, Let that's the wrong button. Suck Fuck. twins. Nope, shit. Toss uh, no. the bomb. Where is it? Did I miss it? Is it quest items? 
Gloves for picking. There it is. All right. Uh, this is the letter, by the way. We never actually read it. This time you must see to our Duquesa. Anna Henrietta knows nothing of empathy. Her heart is cold. This shard of ice you must tear from her breast. You must first snap her neck quickly into effect. Once that is done, Reyna shall go free. Just mask. About, oh, how anything can look interesting when properly lit. Even an old necrophage corpse. You've not an ounce of refinement in you, have you? Oh man, I'm looking stylish. Hell yeah. All right. Man drink. Another one in here somewhere. There's one. I wonder if this is going to ref this is going to be about Regis's lack of desire to continue living, which we kind of read about in his journal. You know, where'd that bloodsucker go? Won't be easy to track down. He's a vampire after all. We must use our witcher Regis. senses to find him. Okay. Damn it, where'd you go? Something here. Where are some footsteps? Uh Regis. Yep. Regis. Damn it, where'd you go? Damn it, where'd you go? Something's making noises over here. Regis. The fuck? You raise oh. your hand against the vampire. You shall die for that. I did what I had to do. Yikes. Death is dead. The unseen shall never forgive. Never forget. Never. I can't see shit. I can't see shit right now. The unseen will never forget. Oh my god, I keep not having Yurden assigned. The unseen shall Bruxy. never forget. They called you a traitor. Alas, we have a very simple code of honor, we vampires. So simple you might call it trivial. Again, the reflection on the theme. Codes of honor. Codes of honor. It would be a more boring name for this DLC, but it could be called Codes of Honor. Those of the knights of the lowly people. Those of the vampires, those of the royalty. Either one is with us, unconditionally, regardless of the circumstances, or... Won't let it go, Regis's will they? life is about to be very difficult. They will not. Fortunately, we have another rule. An unwritten one, and just as trivial as the first. It is neatly summarized in the saying, out of sight, out of mind. That is why I must leave Toussaint. For a vastly long time, most like. Yeah, I get it. Oh, let us make for my camp. I've an overwhelming desire to have another drink. So here's what's going to happen. I'm going to end this episode here in just a second. Um, I would very much ask you to not tell me about the different endings to this DLC, the different dialogue options. I know that I've asked a lot of questions about them during this episode. Please do not tell me. Oh, if you'd have picked something different here. No information, please. I would like to react blind to the different endings and ways that this quest, especially at the end, can happen. So uh, that might be a little bit. I'm not sure if we're going to do that first thing on Monday. It might be something we do a little bit later. But please, if you've written a comment like that, please delete it. If you want to tell me about that stuff, please just hold on to it until I have the chance to see it myself. Um, so, thank you. Got to keep this sucker blind until the very end, this playthrough. Mm, so Bouquet. I'm very interested Firm, in it. Defined beginning, then develops gently, rising to a, a startling finish. Don't you think? I think Not it's pretty much tasty. Of a connoisseur. Then it is high time you started your education. After all, the Corvo Bianco vineyard is now yours. By the way, I left a gift for you at your new home. On the nightstand. <laughs> Thanks. Mind telling me what it is? Ugh, a trifle. That will nonetheless be useful should you need mutagens. Incidentally, 
I Have should. You I will. About what you do with your prize? Shall you hang your swords over the mantel and take to pruning vines? I have to buy some Grandmaster gear. Oh, I think I'll settle down here, there for good. I was made to kill monsters, or I don't know yet. Ooh, I don't know yet. I don't think I'll settle down. Geralt? No way. Uh, don't really know yet. Might find the life of a hardworking vintner too tempting one day. Or maybe I'll just stick to the path, go on roaming, staring up at the stars after laying my bedroll at the roadside. Ah, roadsides, bedrolls, and the sky above. I sense some poetry coming on, which, of course, brings to mind Dandelion. I can remember a night, not too far from here, if I'm not mistaken. We hid in a cave while a blizzard raged all about. Does that sound at all familiar? How could it not? We just set off to rescue Ciri from Vilgefortz. Oh, our encounter with Vilgefortz. That is something I do not remember so fondly. But that first stain, Beauclair, far calmer than this one. <laughs> Seemed like a land straight out of a fairy tale back then. Its sole problem, cellars too small to accommodate all that wine. Appearances, Geralt. Appearances like Mamoons and Dopplers deceive. So what Appearances did become Vilgefortz? Killed him. Sure wasn't easy, though. What about you? What about you? Any idea where you'll go? Distance is of the essence. I thought I might venture south. Nilfgaard? I love Why the music. Not? The Nilf Guardians are a modern society. None there believe in vampires anymore. This fact alone could be very useful to one wishing to remain incognito. Hmm. Interesting point of view. <sighs> I so don't feel like going anywhere. Sit here a while longer? So we shall, my friend. We have witnessed, and in fact on several occasions incited, many great and weighty events. After all that toil, I believe we deserve a bit of a rest. <gasps> that we do. We have witnessed, and I believe incited, a great many weighty events. The turn to camera. Ooh. That is going to do it for today's episode, but don't worry, we're not done with the DLC. Uh, we have plenty left to do and plenty of other endings to watch. Oh my god, that was crazy. I can't believe where we started this episode versus where we're ending it. Uh, this DLC obviously is uh, top tier. Top tier. Uh, I That's been apparent from the beginning, but... It's uh, finale did not disappoint either. If it, if it disappointed at all, it just disappointed in the way that... Ah, I'm going to be questioning myself. Could I have chosen better? I think that I probably could have. There's got to be a world where Anna Henrietta doesn't die. But we'll find that another time. We've got a little bit left to do. Maybe a couple weeks of stuff left to do in the DLC that is not DLC finale related. And then we'll either play it or react ourselves. I pref I would prefer to play to maybe some of the other endings. Uh, I think we should be able to pull that off. So that's what you can expect over the coming weeks. Uh, what an episode, though. Holy shit. Uh, that was crazy. That hugging scene is going to be in my mind forever. Thanks so much for watching. I hope that you enjoyed it. If you did, you know the drill. Like and a comment. I'm going to let these uh, credits play. But. Um, and then and then make sure that I can hop in afterwards. Back into the game. Oh, hi, Hero. Do you want to say hello? You want to say hi? You want to come up? Oh, you have your ball. I see. This? You want me to throw it? Good boy. <laughs> uh, what a DLC what a DLC
Ah, my mind is just racing. There were so many different versions of events. Sorry, there were so many different forks in the last couple of episodes. All the way from deciding how we would go about dealing with Detlef and Siana, chasing after the Unseen Elder, or taking Siana to Detlef, uh, all the way to dialogue options during that final conversation. A lot of different ways that could have gone. I'm going to hit X to skip. I want to... I. Uh, actually, I'd love to go home. There it is. We have a new quest, be it ever so humble. Incredible. Uh, anyways, I'm sure I'll have more to say about this DLC uh, in coming weeks, but... It's been a hell of a good episode. Thanks so much for sharing it with me. Much love from me to you. I'll see you on Monday with another episode. Until then... Bye-bye.